Hello, a common seat I sit in is a transporter, which I'm in again today. This is a T5.1. So I had to look at the dash to confirm because T6s look very similar inside. Um, this has come in for a new head unit, uh, which can do Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Requirements needed to be wireless, so we've done that. We also fitted a reverse camera at the back, which I'll show you shortly. But let's first of all turn it on and show you what it looks like. There you go, so this one is a Kenwood DMX 7722 model, which is a 2023 model. It's got like a, what we call a, you know, an iPad sort of tablet style design. So no physical buttons along the bottom, just the touch sensitive buttons down the side. Now those touch sensitive buttons, are, you know, they can be a bit tricky to use when you're driving, but we don't have a problem on cars that got a multi-function steering wheel because these still work. So this will operate the buttons as I'm see the volume's going up as I'm pushing them there and down. Now this oh, reverse camera will automatically select in reverse. So if we push it in reverse now, the screen automatically comes up, get a good image. This is actually a flush fit camera, but as you can see, you can actually make out some of the tailgate bumper and actually the tow bar, which would help this uh, client obviously hitch up when they need to. And uh, you don't normally get that view on a flush fit camera. You normally have to have one of those, um, those pedestal cameras where you've got like a couple of screws on the side of the camera allows you to adjust it up and down to get different views. But this flush fit one gives you this great view. Um, now, wireless car pair mentioned, obviously it's got DAB radio. It picks up the DAB in this vehicle via a glass aerial, which is that one there. That's one of the areas we fitted. And then the microphone actually is positioned nicely in this fascia here. This fascia actually has a cutout for the microphone. So it's actually behind there. Quite a nice fascia, this one. It's a flush fit, as you can see. So it's literally, uh, you don't have the trim around the Kenwood. It goes right up to the edge. Now let's quickly show you what the camera looks like. And then, uh, yeah, that's it for today. And there is the camera in question. Real nice gloss black, flush fitted for the camera. Extremely nice looking, this one. But yeah, that's all for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel, John Cleese Car Audio. Our email address is info at johncleese.com. And uh, yeah, quick short video of this transport uh, solution. If you like what you see, drop us a comment, give us an email, I'll speak to you soon. My name's Connor, signing off. Ta-ta.